What's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Gat Cognac, back with another just random thoughts video, man. So, my boy Namudi sends me a link to that um, video about the whole WADA scam, about grading and all that shit, where, you know, pretty much the whole thing was set up where they pretty much pumped everything and um, fraudulently made the prices go up while at the same time telling people that work there like, oh, you can't grade your own stuff, man, blah, blah, blah. So in the so-called gaming community nowadays, people are like, mainly resellers, are seeking out sealed games and sending it up into water to grade and most often they're sending like garbage ass titles bullshit y'all already know who i'm gonna be talking about but sending in like ridiculous dumb ass titles that don't even deserve to be graded thinking they're gonna make like hella money off of it and i don't know how much are they making off of that shit and whoever's really buying a fucking jack x or whatever fucking lord of the rings sealed for like fucking five six hundred dollars a thousand dollars you're a fucking dumbass why it ain't worth shit you know but yeah man so now the whole thing's blown and i just remember like a couple days before this even happened me and hyphy go was already talking about how grading is a scam and how we would never do it like i'd never do it man I possibly thought of it, but I looked at it. I was like, I'm not paying them $150 a grade and put some plastic on this shit. I understand if you can grade that shit for like $25, $40, you know, $50 at max, man. But I, I would not send shit in to be grading for more than the, what the game costs. That just don't even make sense, man. That makes no fucking sense at all. So now... I'm pretty much hearing that the market's going to be crashing because all these graded games are just going to plummet. And I'm like, serves y'all right, man. I love it. I relish in these type of incidents. You know that? Because this is where I shine. You know what I'm saying? There's almost like a crash in the market, man, in the stock market. And I'm just going to buy shit up because people are going to be getting desperate trying to unload shit, man. And this is where I shine. This is where I come in and swoop shit up. You know? Oh, you, you want to sell that to me? All right, let me get that. You know? That's what I'm talking about. People are going to be selling shit for dirt cheap. And I'm loving it, dude. So, yeah, man. I, I know, like, some people that actually sent their stuff in the grade. And, you know, if that makes you feel better, go for it. If it, if it makes, like, you know, whatever you put on your shelf look better fine but i even see like local stores that have the graded stuff selling it for like hella overpriced values and i'm like damn dude like really a piece of piece of acrylic i bet you like i could find acrylic and do that shit myself it wouldn't even cost me more than like what 20 bucks and then i'm gonna put like a 10 out of 10 on my shit like fuck it you know maybe that's what i should do Gat Cognac's grading system, man. Everybody gets a 10. How about that? Shit, even you got a busted ass cover. Here, here's your 10, motherfucker. Because I keep a pocket full of dimes. Yeah. So, good shit, man. I'm loving it. So, whoever whoever's like trying to make a living off of this grading shit, man. Good shit. Let y'all lose money. I hope y'all send all your shit in already. You know, and I just find it so funny, man. You know who I'm going to be talking about. Your boy. I see your boy Phoenix Resale. He over here feeling guilty and shit. So <laughs> he over here posting fucking videos talking about, yeah, man, like that, that shit was fucked up. You know, that was shady, but I I'm going to continue like using the service and shit because I got I got bills to pay, you know. I, I'm a, I'm a businessman. Like I, I gotta keep my shit. And I'm like, please, you know. What was you doing before that? 
You know what I'm saying? You'd be bragging about how you made two dollars on a flip on every other game, and you know you did so well. And you know, since you was doing so well, why do you need the grading shit anyways? If that shit was gone, if it's not even there, would it really change what you was doing before? No. So why why even make an excuse that like that's supposed to be affecting your livelihood? Yeah, you you know, because um you found grading games and and it's like fucking making you a little extra money. But you know how it is, man. It's probably the first time he's seen like more dough from from doing this shit because he actually makes I don't know maybe extra hundred dollars off of the grading shit rather than extra five bucks off of the bullshit, man. So that's a big jump, man. That greed gets to motherfuckers. And come on, at the same time, I know the numbers. Like, if you got like 80,000, 100,000 views, man, you're making a solid chunk of dough on, on YouTube. I don't give a fuck what anyone says. Um, especially if you have like, spon- not sponsorships, but, you know, ad revenue and all that shit. That adds up, man. That adds up. Like, you can make some solid ass money at that point where he is. So, like, I don't really think motherfucker is actually hurting for money man so uh stop stop trying to play that bullshit ass game you know fucking sympathy shit and all the dick riders i see in that too the cock riders are come out hard like yeah i don't see nothing wrong he gotta do what he gotta do to pay the bills i'm pretty sure a motherfucker ain't got no problem paying the bills if fucking if the shit's really hurting he'll just run to his fucking mama or some shit and ask for a check you know come on fuck out of here man motherfuckers like me i see through everything i see through it all so that that is what it is man like i said i just find humor in this shit man motherfuckers just fucking funny about shit man you know love to see how these these dudes start acting after after this whole thing plummets man i guess another like grading um company will come out and try to take over and be all honest and shit but in reality are they really that honest i don't think so man i don't think so so that's why that is my cue this is your boy the realest gamer the realest motherfucking collector out there and that is all i got for y'all so it's your boy signing out the fact spitter that's right Come follow me if you want some real shit. I don't fucking bullshit nothing. Laters.